was cracking. Yow out. Let's go. We're going fishing today. Get in. What up, y'all? All right, the hell? I'm on the right side of the car, but I'm on the left side of the road, which means it's the wrong side of the road. You're on the right side, you're on the right side. You know what I'm saying? Buckle up for safety, especially if I'm driving. Bam. <laughs> I was cracking you out. All right, so we are in the Bahamas, probably know. It's early as tits, it's like 7 a.m. right now. We're, we're on the Exuma Islands, and we are heading to uh, go fish with my boy, Stevie. Bonefish Stevie, they call him. Because I'm in the Bahamas, and I know a little bit of, little, little, little thing or two about fishing, and I know that the Bahamas is one of the best spots for bonefish, especially this freaking island right here. And bonefish, if you guys don't know. This small little fish, pound for pound, one of the hardest fighting fish out there. So uh, I wanted to put Miss Outlaw on one of those. Bonefish Stevie seems to catch a lot of them. And then uh, maybe we'll see some other wildlife out there as well. Day two for the ride, mother truckers. Pow! Oh my God. We're in a fucking, uh, uh, oh God. <laughs> We're in a Honda Accord and we in the backwoods at the Bahamas, boy. Look at this freaking road. Jeez. There's creek bottoms and divots all over the place. Big rocks the size of Miss Outlaw's booty. Man, I don't think that's the worst of it. We're going off-roading in an Accord, baby. Luckily, this is a rental. Oh, God, look at that car. Yeah, they, they, them got stuck out here. These are the... These are the fishermen that get stuck out here in their Honda Accord and their Ford Escorts. Stevie's in a four-wheel drive. Dude, just rode with him. Luckily, I know how to drive in this shit. God dang, man. We got the boat ramp now. Got these jigs with some shrimp on the end of it. Double our chances. See what we can get. All right, you know how to cast it out there. Get it out there. There you go. First bony is on. Let's hope we can keep him. Man, look at my rod. He's hanging. She blows the elusive bonefish, ladies and gentlemen. Got to love it. Oh, yeah. Holy smokes! Set the rod down with some shrimp. Look at that. And this thing almost went flying out of the water. We almost lost one of Stevie's rods. We are in really shallow water. These 
these things have 10 times more power in shallow water. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, he's better. Woo! Ooh, that's a good one. Nice. Look how wow. He is. Look at that bonefish right there. Wow. The biggest one of the day. Beautiful. Huge one. Babe, you finally caught a gosh dang fish. Yes, bonefit. Wait, did you what? forget to turn on the mic again? Oh, maybe that's why we're doing this commentary, right? Holy oh, crap, look at the freaking bonefish. Oh, it's a good one, too. My oh, first bonefish. One. Holy smokes, look at the rod, man. Oh, Stevie in. Bonefish Stevie's Stevie. going in for it. There he is. Help me. Oh, yeah. it's a good one. That's a good oh. one. Oh, I mean, what the? Oh, God. Babe. Sorry, little fishy. God dang, what the? Oh. oh, get it, get it. That's the most awkward hold I've ever seen. It in my was life. whipping hey. around. I didn't know how to hey, hold you're it. You're cuddling with the fish. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> oh my gosh. We have a mess right now. I got bit right when Steph was reeling in. Okay. There you go. Teamwork, guys. Teamwork. This is a mess. We're going to cut it as much as we can. I'm going to reel it through the guides. Pray it stays on. Thanks, Miss Atwa. <laughs> Oh, we got oh, it. Oh, we got oh, it. We got it. Here we go. And he's still on there. There he is. Oh, it's not even a freaking bone. Oh, what is that? A uh, shad. Oh, it's a big shad. Yeah, yeah. Big, big shad. I wonder why it could boy. That was a bone. He probably would have Big old shad right there. He's shark bait. fingers you ate last night. Yeah, sorry little guy, you're tasty. <laughs> We just getting done fishing here. We're climbing up this giant freaking rock hill in a Honda Accord. I got me a Sands Bahamian beer, and you gotta love it because the Bahamians around here they just keep the bottle opener on your keychain. Ah, just like that. First day we were here, we we're at the we we're at this restaurant, and we were like, all right, we're gonna go, and our drinks were like half done. We were about ready, and she goes, you take these with you. What do you think? What did she say? She goes, you want to take those with you? And we go, can we? And she goes, yeah. You what think do you think? They're going to lock you up? <laughs> and she laughed. And we're like, oh, wow. We well, didn't know. We're like, actually, yes, we thought that. Because in America, you would get locked up. Yeah. So, yeah. Fun time with Stevie. Perfect time, I guess. Starting to pour. We fished all day. 
from morning until evening and uh just finishing up now so uh yeah we're just uh heading back now miss outlaw caught a nice bone fish i caught like uh 11 and then i caught a barracuda and a hound fish a little needle fish all the ones with the teethy so we we're like well i guess we're just gonna end it on that but it was a good day thanks for staying along with us <laughs> mm, all right we are back from fishing how many did you catch miss outlaw how many bone fish did you catch eh one how many did i catch like nine uh no ten yeah, it was 10, all right? It was a perfect freaking 10, you caught one. So with all you freaking trying to, you, you always trying to compete with me and say you're better. By the way, I whooped your ass in foosball like every single time. You never beat me once here. We got a foosball table upstairs as you guys saw from the house tour video. But you only caught one bone fish. But I caught some other fish and I caught the coolest fish of the day. What'd you catch? A grouper. A grouper? Yep. Dude, I'm telling you guys right now, if you guys ever come to the Bahamas, if they have grouper on the menu, always say yes. No matter it's what so it is, tender. grouper fingers. The grouper here, it's super fresh, like daily. It's, it's amazing. It's usually the catch of the day. The seafood down here is probably, I mean, it's the best seafood I've ever had down here. Like, and I'm an avid seafood lover. It's insane. Mm -hmm. So anyways, yeah, I got more bonefish than Miss Allo. <laughs> <laughs> I've heard a lot about bonefish. I've watched a lot of videos on fishing for bonefish on the fly and on spinning and everything like that. And I knew they fought freaking hard and I knew these little freaking fish were uh, just insane fighters. So I wanted to come down to the Bahamas and try it for my gosh dang self and we got her done. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to smash that thumbs up button if you would like to be down here in the Bahamas catching bonefish as well. Who the tits wouldn't. So make sure to smash that thumbs up button. Ow. Also, guys, I never freaking say this, but make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter. I barely even use Facebook anymore. I think I'll probably do a video on that uh, in a little bit here, but Instagram, Twitter, those are my mo most useful ones. I don't even use Snapchat anymore after that freaking update. Say ya! So, Instagram, Twitter, I'm on there every single day. Follow me up on that song, bitch. I think that's gonna call it a day, mother truckers. Thank you all for coming by, and don't forget to tube in to the next episode. Because Miss Outlaw and I, we're gonna try to go on the hunt for some different species of animals in the Bahamas. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Hit that gosh dang subscribe button. Follow Miss Outlaw and I in the Bahamas. We're going on a hunt for some different species of animals here in Bahamas and they got quite a few of them. So let's do it together, baby. Hit that subscribe button. Love you mother truckers. We'll see y'all on the dip side. But I don't have a dip because it's 18 bucks a can and I refuse to pay that son of a dick. That's expensive. Yeah, that's expensive. So keep it freaking here, Billy, y'all. See you in the next.